Try not to go down on me. What's good, everybody? It's your boy, Sir House of Jazz. Jazz. The piano tutorial man. Back again with another one. <laughs> Classic. Yes, indeedy. And you already know who to feed. The needy. So, yes. Some of you may be like, hey, didn't you just upload a cover of you singing this? Yes, I did. And then all of a sudden, somebody um, paid for the request for this cover. So I was like, well, I can just jump right on to this because I already know how to play it. It's not like I got to sit down for about four or five hours and put the song together, figure it out, type the chord sheet up. And I'm like, no, everything is ready. So I'm like, I can just put this one right on up. So. Yeah, so we're going to knock this one out. Now, as I was playing, I realized I did not have my settings set to flats on here. So I'm going to be ghetto and do it right here in front of y'all. There we go. All right, so now when I play, there we go. We got flat notes now. Okay, so you are holding. So basically, uh, you can just play the verse. The same chords um, that I'm getting ready to show you for the verse, you can use that as your intro. Just play the octave higher. So let's uh, let's just do make up an intro real quick. You can do C, D, then play the C major chord. C on the left, G, C, E on the right hand, and then hit the G again. So go like that. You are O, then hit the G, and then B flat over D, D on the left, B flat D. F on the right hand, C over E, E on the left, G, C, E on the right hand. Then you can do a F add nine. I'll play it easier for you. F on the left, or be honest, you can do F and C if you want on the left hand. You can do that if you want. And then on the right hand, F, G, A, C on the right hand. And then you can kind of walk this up and go if you want to. You don't have to do that walk, but if you want to, you can. But this is the next chord you want to go to F major seven over G. Okay, G on the left and spell the word face with your right hand. F-A-C-E, face, right? And then you just do that exact same thing again. So that's your little intro. Now let's get into the verse, which are, which actually starts with the exact same chords I showed you, an octave lower. So 
<laughs> you just hit the C major chord again, but you're an octave lower. Remember, C on the left hand, G, C, E on the right hand, B flat over D, D on the left, B flat, D, F on the right hand, C over E, E on the left, G, C, E on the right hand. Uh, I'm just going to keep it simple. F add 9. So you can do F and C on the left hand. F, G, A, C on the right hand. And then you can do... This is an F major 7 over G. So G on the left. F, A, C, E on the right hand. And again, like I said, you can walk it up if you want. If you want to do that F, F sharp to that. And then you're going to do those same chords again. You are holy, oh, so holy. But the second time, instead of doing the F major 7 over G, you're not going to play that. This time, you're going to play C over E. Okay, because you can already walk to the next part. Uh, you can almost kind of say pre-chorus if you want. I'm, I'm still calling it the verse on the chord sheet. E on the left hand. G, C, E on the right hand. If you would like a chord sheet, check the description of this video. Um, it's not a lead sheet. I don't have the melody written out. There are no lyrics. It's simply all the chords divided into measures. It's just the chords that I'm calling out on this video. If you would like to have that PDF and document form, check the description on how you can purchase it. Okay. Um, so, so far we have you are holy. Oh, so holy. So I'm going to play it this way for you. You are holy. So holy. Then C over E. What a privilege. So now your next chord would be D minor 7. D on the left. A, C, F on the right hand. Privilege. Hand and honor. Now this is G over B. B on the left hand. G, B, D on the right hand. To worship, then go to a C major chord. C on the left, G, C, E on the right hand. Worship and okay. Now what we're calling this one? I'm gonna call this on the chord sheet. I wrote it as G, um, F sharp seven, but F sharp seven. Um, it says flat five on the chord sheet. Let me. I know on the screen you see sharp eleven. Let me just let you know, flat five and sharp eleven always wound up being the exact same notes so however you want to look at it it's always a sharp a flat five and sharp 11 is always going to be the exact same note in the scale okay so all right so a, a double uh I'll, I'll call it out the way you see it on the screen right here g flat on the left hand g flat b flat and there go your sharp 11 or flat five c <laughs> and then your e okay you're going to play that real fast and come back to your F at nine. F on the left. F, G, A, C on the right hand. Then you're going to move to D minor seven. D on the left. A, C, F on the right hand. Your presence. B flat major nine. B flat on the left hand. A, C, D. F on the right hand. Since as your own. So then you have G sus4, G on the left, G, C, D on the right hand. And then you're going to resolve it to G major, or you can do G at nine. G on the left hand, G, A, B, and D on the right hand. And that's how you play the first two verses of the song. She's in the key of C. Okay, so let me play the whole thing now. The verse, that is. Holy, oh, so holy. You are holy, oh, so holy. C 
over E. What a privilege had an honor to worship at your throne, to be called into your presence as your own. Then do the same thing again. You are faithful, all the same chords. Oh, so worthy. I think it's the worthy is the second verse. You are worthy, oh, so worthy. What a privilege and an honor to worship at your throne, to be called into your presence as your own. And then when it's time to go to the next key, you're going to throw in this one extra chord. This is your like your transition chord. This is a G flat major over A flat. A flat on the left, G flat, B flat, D flat on the right hand. And now you're going to play the verse in the key of D flat. You are faithful. Faithful. Um, how, do I, how am I going to do this? Uh, how do I want to play this? I want to play it like this yeah i'm gonna play it this way you are faithful then you're gonna go oh so faithful so let me show you those chords so you got d flat e flat that's your little melody you are and then you got faithful d flat at nine d flat on the left a flat, D flat, E flat, F on the right hand. Faithful. And this is going to be a slightly different chord from what I did in C major. Uh, what we're going to do is go. So we're going to do B major and we're going to stay on the D flat. When we played it in C major, we kind of moved differently, but it, it gives a, it gives that, it, it makes it sound like the recording when you do it this way. So D flat on the left hand, B, E flat, and G flat on the right hand. So on the right hand, that's a B major. So it's basically B major over D flat. That's named, that's uh, what it's called on the chord sheet. Oh. Um, then you wanna do a D flat over F. F on the left hand, D flat, F, A flat on the right hand. Then you wanna go to a G flat at nine chord. G flat on the left, G flat, A flat, B flat, D flat on the right hand. And if you want, you can walk up. And then this is gonna be your next chord, G flat major seven over A flat. A flat on the left, G flat, B flat, D flat, F on the right hand. Okay, so you got, you are faithful. And then the second time, instead of playing the G flat over A flat, the next, the second time you'll do D flat over F. F on the left, A flat, D flat, and F on the right hand. Just so that there's no uh, confusion, let me start that over. So you, this is how you'll play the third verse up to that point. You are worthy or faithful. Okay, now we want what a privilege. You want to play E flat minus seven, E flat on the left, B flat, D flat, E flat, and G flat on the right hand. Privilege, hand in honor. A flat at nine, A flat on the left, A flat, B flat, C, E flat on the right hand. Honor to worship. B, uh, D flat major. D flat on the left, A flat, D flat, F on the right hand. Worship it. Um, there 
there we go that's the chord <laughs> uh this is a g7 flat five also you can call it g7 sharp 11 the same thing that i explained when we played it as the f uh when i said flat five same thing so on the chord sheet it'll say flat five okay g on the left hand g b d flat and f on the right hand then you're going to come to G flat at nine, G flat on the left, G flat, A flat, B flat, D flat on the right hand. To be called into E flat minor seven again, E flat on the left hand, B flat, D flat, E flat, G flat on the right hand. Called into now keep your right hand exactly where it is. Take your left hand, drop it down to B, and there go your B minor, um, B major nine chord. B on the left hand, and your right hand is still B flat, D flat, E flat, and G flat. And then you want to go uh, A flat suspended four, A flat on the left hand, A flat, D flat, E flat on the right hand. Then you wanna resolve it by taking this D flat and bringing it down to C, A flat. And if you want, you can always add this B flat to resolve it to A flat at nine, okay? A flat on the left hand, A flat, B flat, C, and E flat. So that whole verse in the key of D flat. Sorry, <laughs> faithful. I was getting a little into it, wasn't I? You are faithful. Oh, so faithful. Sorry about that. What a privilege and an honor to worship at your Then resolve it and then all you're going to do you get ready to go to the next section will be as, as. Uh, on the chord sheet is written as f7 sharp 5 sharp 9 you can also look at it as a f augmented 7 sharp 9 as you see on the screen however you want to see it f c uh, not the c just the f and e flat on the left hand a d flat e flat and a flat as, that's your transition chord to the next section of the song. Okay, so that's going to be to be called into your presence as your own, as your own. Okay, now this is the part where it's kind of like a little small instrumental section and she's kind of just kind of doing a little bit of vocal ad lib. You know, she's just kind of... So the chords there are simply B flat minor nine, B flat on the left hand, A flat C, D flat F on the right hand. And then you want to go to E flat minor nine, E flat on the left, G flat, B flat, D flat, F on the right hand. And if you want, you can throw that F seven sharp five sharp nine chord in if you want to. I can't remember if they do it on a recording or not, but you can throw it in there and then play those same two chords again, which is B flat minor nine to E flat minor nine. 
And then after this part, you're going to be playing the same chords until the song ends. So she'll go, I can search the... So you're still playing B flat minor 9, so play the same chord. I can search the heavens high. Then you're going to play E flat minor 9 again. I can search the earth below, but there's... And like I said, if you want to throw that chord in there again, you know, same chord, F7 sharp, 5 sharp, 9. But there's no one. So B flat minor 9 again. Now this is, here's the um, the only four chords I got to show you, and then that's the end of the song. There is no one, no one. Okay, that progression, E flat minor 9. E flat on the left hand, G flat, B flat, D flat, and F on the right hand. No one. D flat major, D flat on the left, A flat, D flat, F on the right hand. Uh, I'm calling this on the chord sheet C on the left hand, uh, B flat, C, E flat and uh g flat on the right hand and on the chord sheet it says c minor seven flat five but it's also known as a c uh half diminished seven i know on the screen it says diminished but this is not a fully diminished chord uh it's only half diminished okay so flat five and then you want to just go to that f7 i'm sorry f sharp seven sharp nine chord Oh, that is different, isn't it? Okay. Sharp 5, sharp 9. I'm sorry. Sharp 5, sharp 9. F, sharp 7, sharp. I need to get some sleep. F, sharp 5, sharp 9 chord. F7, sharp. Y'all know what chord it is. It's F, E flat on the left hand, A, D flat, E flat, and A flat on the right hand. And you're going to play that over and over again. You play that over and over and over again. Um, I can search the winds high. I can search the earth below, but there's no one. There is no one, no one. And even when she goes, no one so. Same chords. No one so worthy. No one so faithful. There is no one, no one. And whenever you're ready to end the song, just end it on a B flat minor nine chord. But you're literally playing those chords throughout the rest of the song. You just keep playing those chords. You know, until, like I said, when you're ready to end the song, just end it on the B flat minor nine chord. Okay, which is I already spelled it out for you, but B flat on the left hand, A flat, C, D flat, and F on the right hand. So hopefully that helped you out. And uh, you can use it for praise and worship. Uh, my choir is actually singing this song tomorrow morning as uh, we do two selections. It's going to be our first choir selection so we'll, i'll be playing this again tomorrow morning <laughs> I, uh, hopefully like i said you enjoyed it you can use this and i will definitely catch you on the next one peace